Hi, good evening, my Dominican folks. It's me. I took a little time off my um, Baltimore watch to come and say something about my love, Dominica. <laughs> Dominica, my love. Scar was yapping his mouth a lot today. He was just yapping, 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 yapping today. <laughs> He said a lot of things. I see he said that he projects economic growth, that the economy is looking like it's going to grow. <laughs> I, I, I did not pick that one. I did, this one would make a very interesting, interesting commentary. But I'm not commenting on this one tonight. I am commenting on the one tonight. Let's say tonight is a comedy night. <laughs> it's just plain pure comedy tonight. So I will pick the one where Skerritt said that the Lindo Park matter is not political. <laughs> Dominican people, do you believe that for one minute? If you believe that, it is worse than I thought. So, DNO reports. Thank you, DNO. Thank you very much. <laughs> DNO reports, people. I have to come up close, <laughs> very close to this one. Prime Minister Roosevelt Skerritt has said, in good conscience, with a straight face, <laughs> uh, has said that the halting of the project at the Lindo Park in Goodwill is not political. <laughs> But all about the laws, the laws of Dominica and the use of state property. <laughs> this is a joke. Eh? It has to be a joke. Scary talking about laws and the use of state property. Scary just walks on Dominica's laws as he wants, like he thinks he's above it. This man really and truly and honestly thinks that he is above the law, that everybody else is subjected to the law except him. Scarrett said no law, no policeman, not even the Constitution can prevent him from doing what he wants to do when he went to nominate himself for as a candidate for the Vickers constituency in 2001. No law, no police, no lawyer, not even the constitution that can prevent Skerritt, the one that is above the law, to do what he wants. And Skerritt has the audacity to come and tell Dominica about laws of land. Recently, the plan division stopped the project being carried out by the Lindo Park Improvement Committee on the basis that it was being done without government's permission or approval. <laughs> so, the, so, Lapland people, Boetica people, Grandfather people, when you guys want to do a little improvement, on a new little playing field to make life easier for all your community, all you have to go to Skerritt for approval. All you have to go to King Skerritt because remember people, when Skerritt talks about the governments, he talks about him. He is the government. Skerritt is the government. All those little puppets he has in different stations where he need them, where he want them to pick up after him and do his dirty work for him. They don't count for anything. Skerritt is the government of Dominica. The Prime Minister addressed the matter on Wednesday 
pointing out that the Linda Park State property and no one, not even state agencies, has the authority to appear or take ownership of state properties. Who is taking ownership of it? Who is taking ownership of Linda Park? I thought they were improving the park for the, for the use of the people of the community. Who, who's taking over the park, Scarlett? Who's taking over the park, Scarlett? But you will give your core, your core con artists that you meet all over the world in your travels, government property, state property, national park property, when you want, how you want, after you give it to them, you will come in parliament and make your zeze with Austria and all your little puppets. Oh, yeah, yeah. Boy, I, I don't know how Dominic can take that. I really, really cannot understand how all you can take that. I couldn't take it. <laughs> I couldn't take it. I couldn't take it. I could not take it. Dominicans, alas, especially the people who are fighting for change in Dominica, it is not for the faint-hearted. It takes courage. It takes determination. It takes bravery to do that. It takes determination. Because I don't know how you people can take that. I don't know how you people can take that. I, 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 can't, I can't take it. I would not be able to take it. The state must be engaged and proper arrangement must be entered before the state and any private party, between the state and any private party, he stated. Not even a government agency can take over state property without the proper following through of the provision of the law. Scar talking about law, that must be a joke, that is comedy, that is comedy. He noted that in such matters, transparency is important. Scarlet, shut up your mouth about transparency. Don't utter the word transparency, account the words transparency, transparency, accountability, and law scarlet. These words should not come out of your dirty lying mouth scarlet. Do not mention these words scarlet. I hope one day when you mention one of them, you choke to death as your punishment for lying and deception. Scarlett said, the government is holding its ground on the matter and it's, it has nothing to do with politics. Of course. Of course, it has nothing to do with politics. Nothing, 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 not a thing. It has to do with politics. You think anybody going to believe that, Scarlett? I certainly don't. It has everything to do with politics. Not you, Scarlett. Not you. You cannot help yourself. You cannot help yourself. You see that you, that little dictator there, you cannot help it. You cannot help yourself. He said that the government will seek to have the matter properly stated and clarified, to have the matter properly stated and clarified, so everyone understands what's taking place. Meanwhile, MP4 Rosso constituency, Rosso North constituency, Daniel Luge, told, <laughs> told privately on Q95 earlier this week that the committee had written to the authorities they believed were supposed to be contacted for permission However, they could have made an error because you did not contact Scarlet. You did not contact the king. You have to contact the king. No department, no governmental department cannot do anything. The king himself must do it. You have to go kiss his ring. You didn't go kiss the king's ring, so you cannot get permission. He is showing you people who is boss in Dominica. He runs things. <laughs> we are in discussions with the city council, for example, he said. The local government commission, we wrote to them, so the authorities, we figured that we need to approach for the permission. We did. 
We got the okay from the city council. They had no objection, of course. Why should they object? Why should they object if you're trying to improve the city of Rosa? You're an improvement committee and you're improving a little spot in Rosa. Why should they object to that? They have no reason to object. They shouldn't. They shouldn't. But you did not go to the king. You did not go and kiss the king's ring. Remember, remember people, anything you want to do, forget about governmental departments. They don't exist. They are just, they are just um, <laughs> window dressing. They do not exist. You need to go to kiss the king's ring when you want to do something in Dominica. Remember that. Don't forget that now. Do not forget that. Do not make the mistake of not going to kiss the king's ring when you want to do something in Dominica. <laughs> Ooh, we have also another letter from another government department who had no problem with the project. He further stated that the committee later received a letter from one of the divisions of government asking that the project should be put on hold. Of course, the king found out that they gave permission and the king told them, who tells you to do that? Did, 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 did I tell all you can, you can do that? All you cannot do that. Go stop them. Go stop them. Let me get Kamala. Let me get Kamala on Kyrie to tell them to go stop them. <laughs> <laughs> That's how it works. That's how it works. <laughs> which we have done, of course. Which we have done. Luge is hoping that the project will be completed soon. We are waiting permission from the authorities to continue, he said. We are hoping that this would be sought out soon enough because the deadline for completion of the project best is a request from the Australians is to coincide with the test match against Australians in June. You see how they keep in progress? I remember what had happened to, to the little sports stadium the French government had given to Patrick John in Canfield. And when Eugenia came into power, she bulldozed it and put an industrial place in the middle of a residential area. I mean, this is not the same thing, but it's kind of, it's, 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 it's in the same class. It's in the same class. It's not scary that doing it. They want UWP, oh, go do this, go do that, go do that. They're not even in government, but go do this, go do that. And when they show them that they can do something, those bastards will stop it. <laughs> they will stop it. And Dominicans will believe scary. Dominicans will believe scary that this is not political. It is about law and the use of government state property. Scary stop insulting the intelligence of the Dominican people. You have done that enough. You have done that enough. Scary stop it. Please stop it. Stop it. He explained that the project also involves the lighting of the football area, which will be used for both football and cricket. A fence and a jogging area will also be built. Why should Skerritt object to that? Why should Skerritt object to that? Why should Skerritt object to that? This is just vindictive. Skerritt is just vindictive and dictatorial. He just wants to show the opposition and Danny Lube, I am the boss here. And you cannot do things if I don't approve of it. And those little puppets he have in the different, you know, governmental departments. Yes, your highness. <laughs> All that is in that Dominica there. All that is in that Dominica there. The project is being sponsored by the Australian Direct Aid for the Australian High Commission in conjunction with the New Zealand High Commission. It is managed by the Lindo Park Committee. And the other thing is Scarrett. Scarrett wanted his cut. He wanted his cut in the morning. He and Australia, they wanted, they wanted something for them to send in their um, offshore accounts. And all you deprive them on that. All you go and do something that is above board. How can you do something that above board? We're not going to get a cut from it. We got to stop this thing. We got to stop this thing. <laughs> Good night, Dominicans. <laughs> Good night. <laughs> you see, 
I'm in my little black and white dress. I think I could still could go in it. I still can go in it. I still have a lot of space in it too. <laughs>